Okay, today we have another Williams Super Ratchet. This one's a quarter inch drive, vintage NM51, Williams USA. Funny thing about this ratchet and compared to ratchets, quarter inch ratchets today, this this ratchet is tiny, it's like four and a half inches long. I think you'd be hard pressed to find a, a ratchet this small today. There's a switch. Very coarse. Okay, let's take a look inside. This one, like other Williams, has this, has a ring that, that you have to uh, loosen up to get a peek inside. Usually when you first get these, if they're old and well, well, well worn, you might have to put some penetrating oil into these grooves before you start. And then maybe take a, a little flat, flat nail or something. And maybe a small hammer and tap it back and forth. Tap it back and forth little by little to loosen it up. You don't. You don't want to go too hard because, you know, something this old, you might strip out these threads. So, it's like, be careful. <laughs> go easy. Okay. Retaining plate, and when you get these, if they're old, like I said, these these holes are gonna be full of dirt and stuff, grease. You wanna first thing get all that grease and dirt out of there before you try to knock this loose. Okay. Here's the anvil and teeth. Very coarse. As you can see. Pretty simple. Here's the inside. The pole just has two teeth, which uh, for something this coarse and for a quarter inch drive, that's plenty. You see the two teeth in there. Here are the grooves, serrations for the for the retention plate. I'm not gonna totally tear this one down because something this vintage, this small and fragile. If I try to pull this pin out, it'll probably break. So I guess I just leave that alone. You see this cap here, it's separate from the pole because you see it moving there, independent of the pole. It's 
So if I want to take this apart, I have to knock this pin out. Uh, um, yeah, I think <laughs> if I do that, I might might not be able. Probably break it and not be able to put it back together again. So putting it back together, well, super simple. Put it, put the anvil back in, back in the housing. You take your attention plate. Grooves. If I can get it to go in the grooves. And let's make it secure. I don't, I'm not gonna torque this down all the way. Put a bunch of pressure on it. They might deform the the holes there and make it look all all ratty. So just make it kind of finger tight. And uh, that should be it. It's working. Well, that's the Williams NM fifty one USA ratchet. If you like these videos, do me a big favor and uh, give me a thumbs up. And also, if you can, could you subscribe for me and. If you have any suggestions or any comments, yeah, just drop me a line down in the comments if you want to see any particular ratchet or anything like that. Let me know if I have it. I'll put it up. Okay? Have a good one. Thanks.